Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. This week I think we should dive into the pentatonic scale and kind of dissect it a little bit, see what it is that makes it so fun and easy to play. So grab your guitars. <laughs> We all love it. The pentatonic scale, particularly in the A minor position, which is technically the first position of that scale. So let's pick it apart a little bit and see what's going on there. So we start with the A, we skip over the B because we don't use the two in a pentatonic. And we go to the C because a major scale would be C sharp. So we flatten it to become a minor. That's A, C. D is the fourth. E is the fifth. Skip over the F to the G, and then back to the A. A, C, D, E, G, A. The pentatonic scale. Two notes per string, super easy to play. And such a lovely sound. Hey, Jay, <laughs> let's show them that really cool thing where you slide it on over and you can play the same shape. What is that about? Ah, yes, relative major and minor. So if we have the pentatonic at A minor, with that flat at third, if we take our first finger and move it to where your pinky is, that C, you wind up with the C major scale just by playing those exact same patterns. Because both of them have no sharps or flats. C, E, F, G. off that cheat sheet I had you make up a few weeks ago and you'll see that the Ionian the major scale is going to match somewhere in the list another Aeolian scale because they all contain the same notes so if you have a major scale that contains one two sharps look up an aeolian that contains two sharps and those notes are probably going to match and that's the pentatonic scale what it's composed of how it works why it works and also how to turn that into a minor to a major so like subscribe share Leave a comment, tell me about your guitar journey so far, and I'll see you next week with a new video.